Warriors on ABC. We outworked you. And then when the chance came, we outwilled you. I just had that mindset right from the beginning. You are not finished. Eastern Conference basketball after dark. A late tip time here in Milwaukee at Pfizer Forum as the reigning champion Bucks welcome the New York Knicks. Both teams looking to close out a rough month on a positive. Milwaukee currently in sixth in the East. The Knicks in 12th right now with Atlanta winning, but New York is only a half game out of the play-in tournament. And the Bucks are not panicking. A confident team after the championship run last year. And Doris Burke, when you have a player like Giannis, you can understand why you'd be confident. But how about the reigning finals MVP is in the midst of the longest streak of his career with 25 or more in 14 straight games. This is not a strength, but to me, he's gaining confidence, but this is where he's just so dangerous. Around the rim, in transition, one of the most effective finishers. He's shooting almost 70% in transition. Might want to keep him out of there. Take a look at the starting lineups for tonight's game. For the New York Knicks, the same five that they've been starting for the last few weeks with Kemba Walker, Evan Fournier in the backboard, Barrett, Randall, Mitchell, Robinson in the middle. And for the Bucks, Grayson Allen is back after a one-game suspension. He'll start with Holiday, Middleton, Giannis, and Bobby Portis. The Knicks at 23 and 26, the Bucks at 30 and 20. They are 17 and 8 here at home. Knicks have lost five of six overall. And a game under 500 away from Madison Square Garden. about the Milwaukee Bucks coming off that loss to Cleveland where Giannis said we were awful. He used a different word than I will use, but how motivated are they at home to follow that up? Crowd on its feet for the opening tip-off. Portis and Robinson in midcourt. Into the arms of Kemba Walker, 11th year 